Under the skin of these mountains between Croatia and Slovenia, the big carnivores are back. In retreat for decades because of human activity, lynx, bears and wolves have increased in numbers thanks to more protective legislation. Dina works with a European cross-border project, Carnivora Dinaritsa, which aims to protect these three big carnivores and to improve coexistence between them and humans. Here in the Rignac National Park, Dina is, for us, the eyes of the forest. So it could be, for instance, a dog or, or a fox or a wolf, and it's probably a wild animal, because dogs usually just, uh, they wander around a lot, sniff, so their footprints are, are all over the place, whereas wild animals like foxes, and especially wolves, they like to keep the straight line. At present, in these mountains in the Dinaric Alps of southeastern Europe, there are thousands of bears, hundreds of wolves and about 70 lynx. A number of concrete actions have been put in place to complete this cross-border project at a cost of 2.3 million euros. The European cohesion policy is responsible for 85% of the funding. The remaining 15% is covered by other entities which are also involved in the project. Thomas's farm in Suhoya has been voted the best practicing farm. It has 16 horses and a herd of sheep and goats, animals exposed to attacks from large carnivores. In order to avoid them, he will install a 1 meter 70 centimeter electric fence, which bears can't destroy and wolves can't cross. It's very important that the fence always has electricity, even if the animals are not in the pen. That way, large carnivores will associate touching the electric fence with pain and no longer approach, no longer attack the livestock. 30 minutes away in Pivka, Alesh's herd is protected by a totally different measure offered by the project, guard dogs which he trains. Sir, you are in danger because of the wolf whole year. I have some dogs, they are scaring somehow the wolves away from here. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the wolf is too clever to go to, to battle with, with big dog, yeah, so he's, you know, why would I fight for one piece of meat with a dog that I can get one in, in the nature without a fight, yeah. Back in Rignac, we discover the bones of a red deer devoured by wolves, but that doesn't mean we should be afraid of big carnivores. Uh, you have to know a lot about their bi biology and ecology in order to understand them and to accept them how they are. And this way, um, you can coexist with them more properly or better.